In this video, we are going to look at arthrokinematic assessment and treatment for the ventral capsule of the talocrural joint. Get our very own assessment ebook and mobile app. Links are in the video description. Hi and welcome back to PhysioTutors. The aim of role glide assessment is to gain information on the reactivity of the joint and of course articular problems such as capsular limitations. For role glide assessment, have the patient in prone lying position and the knee bent to 90 degrees. Then place the web of the hand of one hand over the neck of the talus and the other hand over the plantar aspect of the calcaneus. In this case, the talus is convex and the tibia is concave, so we will have to roll and glide in opposite directions. The roll of the talus is going to be in dorsal and distal direction, as the tibia is longer posteriorly, and the glide is going to be ventrally and proximally. In this position, we can position the joint line horizontally by flexing the knee further than 90 degrees. Then apply the roll with one hand and the glide into the opposite direction. Optionally, you can have the patient in prone lying position with the foot over the edge of the bench. Then you can induce the roll with one hand over the talus from medially and the gliding component by pushing on the calcaneus. Assess for movement quality during roll and glide, possible pain provocation and end feel. For end feel assessment, roll and glide to end range. Then assess if further gliding is possible or not. In a hypomobile joint, the glide is reduced relative to the roll component, so no further gliding is possible. If you feel that the end feel or movement quality is abnormal, you can directly move further from assessment to intervention, as the movements that are performed are essentially the same. When used as an intervention, make use of the Maitland grades of mobilization to dose your techniques depending on your goals. Check the video in the top right corner to learn more about that. Okay, you've reached the end of the video and if you like, you can check out more videos on manual therapy in the playlist to my left. Again, check the info icon in the top right corner for the featured videos and also take a look at the links in the video description down below. At last, subscribe to our channel if you haven't yet and hit the bell icon next to the subscribe button. This will let you know once we release new videos. As always, this was Andreas for PhysioTutors. I'll see you next time. Bye.